Hey, it's Troy Huggett from Fitness Pros. Uh, last time we met, we talked about the uh, depletion of glycogen stores and how we had discovered at Fitness Pros through my mentorship team and many of the folks that I've worked with over the years, how we can have a significant impact on A1C levels, uh, diabetes medication reduction, as well as elimination and possible in uh, many cases, um, obviously done through the medical team. But the best way to deplete glycogen stores, and we talked a little bit about this last time, is through high intensity training, which is strength training, uh, taking the muscle to total uh, momentary muscular fatigue. Uh, sometimes we call it failure, but that's a little bit negative. But it's the, uh, the point where the muscle can no longer lift it's achieved everything that it could possibly offer you at that moment, and it's just done. So we do that in a very unique way, utilizing one set of a very slow, very controlled approach to the, uh, to the intensity that we're looking at. So it's safe, it's something that you can handle, but it actually depletes more glycogen from the cell, that's the sugar from the cell. We don't want to get into a, a big explanation on all that. You guys understand this. If you're a diabetic, you know what this means. Um, but basically, you're looking at the depletion of that sugar inside the cell, and then the body goes out and brings the sugar out of the bloodstream, puts it into the cell, and then that's where it needs to be and it's out of the blood sugar, thus lowering the sugar levels. And the best way to do that is with a very slow, purposeful, controlled motion on every exercise and deplete that muscle of as much glycogen as possible and your blood sugar will lower down. You need to track this. Be very cautious when you do it uh, and just watch it and just track it after your workouts, before your workouts and within several weeks you'll have it totally figured out and you'll know exactly how that's going to impact you and what you need to do to modify it and just work closely with your medical team your healthcare professionals that you're working with and uh, let's watch those A1C levels drop significantly in the next three months alright have a great day and remember it's maximum results minimum time have a great day